Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Olivia. And in this video, I'm so excited because I'm going to be making a time capsule. So, um, I got this idea. I've seen it a couple times on YouTube and I just think it's such a cool idea. I have already made a, like a time capsule video before that I haven't watched yet because it hasn't been the amount of time, but I thought it would be so cool to make a time capsule. So I'm also going to be going through what I'm doing and I'm going to show you guys how I do it um, and I'm so excited. So let's just get started. Yes guys, I may or may not be in my uniform top, but it's fine. It kind of looks a little bit cute. All right guys, so I have made a list on this page here, so I'm so excited to get started. All right guys, so I'm kind of trying to get you at a good angle, but you still can't really see the floor, but it's okay, I'll figure it out. Um, so the first step that I'm doing is finding out what I'm putting my stuff in. So I've chosen a shoe box. So I found this shoe box, it's Nike, and it kind of like opens like Oh, you have to open this thing and then it like opens like this, kind of. So I thought that was quite, oh, and it, I thought that was cool. And it's kind of like white and plain, but it still has some writing all over it. And so I thought maybe it would be cool if I could somehow like put wrapping paper around it. I walked outside and my mom is cl currently cleaning a closet out and I just came across this like regular, it kind of looks like, I don't even know what to call this. Like it kind of looks like just paper, but it's kind of like wrapping paper and it's also cool because then I can write on top of it and write something. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it in this. All right guys, so I know this is a bad angle, but I just finished wrapping it and then I just drew some stuff, but I'm not an artist. So this is what I came up with. So on the front, I just wrote Olivia Pops time capsule. And in the bottom here, I wrote the date, which is October 14th, 2020. And then on the side here, I just kept this part white because it was just white. But I wrote when to open it. And for some reason, I just started writing September and I was like, if I cross this out, it's gonna look ugly. But it's beginning of October. So I mean, if I would have made this a couple weeks ago, it would be September. So I just wrote open only in September of 2025 because I've decided to open this time capsule in five years. So the next step is to put all the stuff I want in it. So I think what I'm gonna do for this is I'm just gonna take a time lapse of me and then afterwards I'll explain everything that I put in it. So cue the time lapse. <laughs> So it is a while later, about two hours almost. And as you can see, it's dark outside because the lighting's all weird. But um, I think I've completed my time capsule for now at least. Um, I'm gonna add some more stuff tonight, but I'm gonna show you guys everything I put in it. All right, so in the box part of it that goes into the part I showed you before, the first thing that I've got in the box is a letter that I wrote to myself. So on the envelope, it just says, Dear Olivia, from you and... F 
oh from you five years ago and so i'm excited to open this i just wrote a whole bunch of stuff in it and you guys are gonna have to i assume in five years I will open this on camera. So you're, I'll probably read the letter, I'll read all of this to you guys when I upload that video in five years. So hopefully you stick around until then, hopefully I stick around on YouTube until then, and then I can open it on camera and that's when you can see all this stuff. And if you are here from me in five years telling you to go watch this video to see what I put in here at this time Oh my gosh, that's crazy So anyways the next thing that I have I just have a whole bunch of little sticky notes in here six and they're all like predictions or assumptions or like where I want to be in five years. I wrote like if I want, like hopefully I'm in university and then I wrote what I'm thinking right now, what I wanna do for university. I wrote stuff about my exchange to Germany and hopefully I'll be able to go and stuff like that. I wrote, I wrote about some stuff that I hope I've accomplished. And then I also wrote some assumptions about my family members, just my mom and dad and my brother, where I hope they'll be in five years. And then I wrote some what I hope, where I hope I am with YouTube in five years. So I'm excited to see if these change. Like, it's so crazy. Like, when I read this, everything could be so off. And I could I could be doing the opposite of what I wrote what I'm thinking I want to do now so that's really crazy to think because I Don't know. It's just really crazy. And then another thing that I've got in here Is this page that I made and it's an all about me page So I wrote stuff about me now so I wrote my name today's date my age my height my weight my shoe size uh, what I want to be when I'm older, my favorite books, sports, food, subject in school, color, place to travel, season, and animal. And so I just thought this would be cool for me in five years to see what all my favorite things were, what I wanted to be, and like see how much I've grown. Hopefully I've grown in height um, and stuff like that. I thought it would be really cool to see. And then that's all that's in here right now, but I'm hoping I can get some more stuff in there before I like close it up for five years. Um, one thing is I want my parents to write me a letter. So I want each of my parents to write me a letter that I can open in five years. I don't know what they're gonna write. Um, I hope they kind of write along the same lines as what I wrote in my letter that I wrote to myself, like where they hope I'll be, maybe where I am right now, stuff like that. And like, I'm so excited to open open it in five years like I'm just so excited so I'm gonna get them to write a letter to me and then another thing I want to add is the mask because it's COVID time right now but I currently don't have a medical mask and I don't want to put like a good mask in there because then I won't have it so I'm just gonna grab a medical mask and put it in there probably so I'm excited to put that in there and then when I open in five years hopefully I'll be like what what the heck is this there was no coronavirus it didn't ruin my life at all so hopefully it's gone in the next couple months but let's let's keep the let's keep the positive vibes up let's hope it's gone as soon as possible so the last thing i'm gonna add that i haven't decided on what i'm gonna do for it yet is some pictures maybe some pictures of me now where I can be like, ooh, I look young in this picture, or maybe some pictures of what I like to do, or something like that. Um, I still haven't decided what pictures I wanna put. So you can also add like literally anything you want into your time capsule. Um, there were a lot of other ideas I found online when I was looking up what you can put in a time capsule, but these are just the stuff that I wanna put in mine and stuff that I think will be exciting to see in five years. So I'm so excited to open it. I hope this video was helpful if you wanna make a time capsule or I hope it was interesting 
if you're just watching this video. That is it for the video. I hope it helped you. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe down below if you like this video and you want to see more of me. Also make sure to click the notification bell so you get notified every single time I post a new video. And make sure to like this video if you liked it because I'd love to know if you actually liked it or not. And that's basically all. Also make sure to follow me on Instagram in case you just want to because I can't force you to do anything. So this is all just stuff like if you want to do it, you can do it. So thank you so much for watching and I am so excited to open this time capsule in five years. And I will see you guys hopefully in my next video. See you later. Bye.